Today we're looking at creating a drip bead over some lead flashing. Now this is the float I'll be using, this is a Rafina Diamondback float and I'll be honest, throw your poly floats away because this is a real game changer. It's solid, it's lasted me for a good year and a half and it constantly keeps its square shape which is ideal for these moments when you're trying to form new angles, forming new shapes. And like I said, this is, um, this is a detail over lad flashing. So all is a stop bead that runs across the flashing and then the render's butted into it. Now this is the Rafina poly float, not endorsed by Rafina, but the floats and the sponges are brilliant. So this little detail that creates it adds a bit of interest to the render, but it also keeps the, the whole building fully watertight so no water is going to be getting in from any angle. And this poly float with the Rafina float is just a brilliant combination. And this is it, the finished job. We've got the render running round and you've got the lead flashing with a nice detail there.